Hello everyone, welcome to IT Expert. Today we are going to see project about Bhavati direction, Bhavati prediction using satellite imaginary. In this project, we are going to predict Bhavati level of the particular place. For example, you can choose Chennai, Hyderabad or else India. We can going to predict the Bhavati rate of particular places using satellite imaginary. Usually Bhavati level, Bhavati rate very important for the country. Each country is spending his own money to development of the each and every places. For that, they have to capture the poverty level. So, if you are going for the existing system, means in existing system, everyone using direct survey, they can appoint some person directly. That that person may visit the each and every home separately. They can take survey how much earning they are earning like that. From that, they can form the poverty rate of the each and every places. So this is the existing level of existing method for predicting the poverty level. In this project, we are going to use satellite imaginary. You already know what is satellite image. Okay. For example, you can take Gmail, Google Map. We are going to use that type of imaginary of the place for detecting the particular poverty rate. How it is possible? This is completely impossible. You may tell. Okay. So first of all, we have to see PPT of this project. So this is PPT of this project. In this project, clearly I mentioned that in this work we are going to use deep learning computation method for detecting the power theory of the particular place by using satellite imaginary as well as nighttime imaginary. You can see if you are giving one satellite image of the particular places means we have to consider various factors from that image. In paper they have used in paper they have used deep deep neural network as a existing system. In our proposed system, we are using recurrent neural network as a proposed system. This is the clear difference. We are going to use satellite imaginary. From the satellite imaginary, we have to estimate what are the roof type they have used. For example, they may use the cement concrete as a roof or else a, a old type of traditional old type of roofs they have used. We have to predict what type of roofs most of the homes used in that place. What are the source of lighting? How much light intensity that city may have? Okay, we have to use that also. Then what we are going to use means we have to use how much water body it contains, how much agriculture areas contain, how much industrial areas available, how much industrial uh, places available, stadium like stadium. Then we are going to use how much roads are covered, what type of roads are used. From that, we have to give point positive as well as negative points. Okay. From that, we are going to use, we are going to predict power the left left place. You may tell this is difficult. This is completely difficult. It, it won't give you the accurate result. We have to see the paper. They have already completed various places in exiting system itself. They have predicted Bangladesh power the rate as a minus 0.31, but actual Bangladesh power the rate minus 0.40. Nearly both are same. As well as you can compare with Albania also. For Albania, they have predicted using satellite image 1.23. Actual Albania power rate 1.26. Both are same. You can check Cambodia. Actually, they have uh, Cameroon. They have predicted minus 0.41. Actual rate minus 0.48. So satellite imagery as well as direct survey. Both are nearly same. So the system was working. The system perfectly working. This is the conclusion they have given. Okay. So this is the complete PPT. We are given introduction existing system in existing uh, as I already mentioned we are using direct survey it contains high cost as well as time okay it may take high cost why because we have to give salary for the person who are collecting the data as well as it may take some time also this is the exiting main problem in proposed system as I mentioned earlier we are going to use completely satellite imaginary as well as nighttime imaginary from the only we are going to use the data set already contains 88,000 images for training the each city. We are using recurrent neural network as our proposed system in the project. This is the complete working of the project. This is the proposed system block diagram. We have to extract villages location or places location. From that we have to generate seven data set. How much water bodies, how much roof types, what are the industrial areas, what are the agriculture areas, what are the road types. Like that you have to extract everything and then nighttime images also. From that you have to train and give the power the rate. Okay, you have to predict the power the rate from that. This is the models, everything available. This is a sample satellite imaginary. Okay. 
so this is the models and everything those who are purchasing project we can give you everything we are going to use python for this okay so before that if you need any project means follow iwexpert.com uh, without wasting time i'm going to run the project for you so this is the project code i'm going to run so just i'm copying the project location this is the project complete code we are used to complete code just i'm copying the location then i'm going to run using anaconda i'm going to use cd space project directory link then i'm going to use python space app.py i'm going to run using python space app.py so it will create the website address for us we have to wait for the website to appear so it's running currently so it will create a local host address based on the coding then form it will create a local host address this is the local host address we have to copy that local host address we have to paste it here in our browser so this is our project home page draw our power the prediction using satellite images as i mentioned earlier we are using a recurrent neural network which is which give you the 98 percent accuracy we are using 60 6000 plus geological data then this is completely a web application based project you can see the project abstract also even then you have to give login here so this is login form i am using admin admin as my user id and password admin admin as my user id and password once you login success directly you can go for the clustering pages so this is the clustering page here you have to give the satellite image what are places you can give you can give hyderabad chennai what are places directly from google map you can drop the location and can, you can give it here okay just i'm choosing file i'm going to use some images here so directly you can use any images i'm using some sample images here sample satellite images and just give one places for example i'm going to give uh, telangana telangana satellite images i'm going to give so then you have to give number of cluster how much cluster you have to split for example road how much road uh, land type root type uh, agriculture area industrial area like that i'm going to split as a five cluster then use submit so you have to check for the web publication so web publication can reload the content after reloading it will generate the results so wait for the web publication to generate my results see that it saved as a original image still that it's running it will split that image into five different cluster based on the image property so we have to wait for the clustering application to complete so see that is performing the maximum likelihood operation here it will perform 10 iteration that means 10 features it will extract based on the 10 features only it will predict the power theory so first iteration has been done we have to wait for the 10 iteration so iteration 2 has been completed it performing each and each part of the image whatever satellite image you are uploading now it will perform the feature extraction operation on each and every each and every part of the image then only it will give the accurate results okay we have to wait for the 10 iterations to complete so third iteration has been completed so this is the maximum likelihood how much power the likelihood this is the likelihood so we have to wait for the 10 iterations 10 features have to complete so the 10th iteration has been completed after the 10th iteration completed if you going for the research means so this is the image which you are given okay so this is the image which you are given this is the extracted sample you can see it can plot at the agriculture area as well as building area roads as well as the waste land it separated everything so original image as well as cluster image different features then we have to give for the next step. so after next step what i'm going to use means 
again I'm going to feed the same images here. So this is the image I have checked and, and I am giving same image as a final power rate prediction. So it will give final power rate of the image. See that. So this is the image you have given. So the wealth classification bright. The overall predicted wealth index was 4.16. This was very high. Okay. So the place which you are checking was very wealthy places. Power T index was 4.16, which is good. So for your example, again I'm going to check another images here. So I'm going to choose different images now. For example, this is the most crowded part of the Hyderabad. I'm going to give same five cluster here. So I have to wait for the cluster to complete. See the clustering happening. So you have to wait for the 10 iteration now. So now iteration performing very fast. Why? Because images which you are giving was high contrast image. That's why. So see the output. So this is the Hyderabad image you are given. It is the features, extracted features image. Then you can give for the final results. Then you have to choose same images here. So I am going to choose most crowded part of the Hyderabad now. I am going to choose final results. So this is the final result. So wealth index was very bright. So predicted wealth index was 3.16. So this is the this is also good when compared to wealth index. So you can check for another uh, other areas also. For example, so choosing Patna images, nighttime images. You can give any images, any city, not any. Issue. So while checking the Patna images, the classification was medium. The Patna, Bihar state, wealth index was 0 0.89. It will predict everything very perfectly. Okay, it will predict everything. You can choose any places. The output will be very perfectly. So we can make some analysis based on that. We can go to analysis page. Then you can choose for wealth chart. So once wealth chart came in, so you can see the overall India wealth chart formed based on our various analysis. You can see the south um, uh, southern part of India having major wealth index as well as the Delhi region having major wealth index. So the poor rate comes under this uh, Bihar, uh, Uttar Pradesh, this part, Jharkhand, this part are having very poor rate. Okay, based on this software which were created, then the world wealth distribution graph. You can see this orange and everything having good wealth rate. You can see red was very poor. You can see the South African country having poor rate as well as this Brazil, southern part of America having poor rate. This is the world wealth graph. As well as you can see African wealth distribution index. So this is uh, minus this lighter part having minus data. This darker circle having plus data. You can see for the African wealth in distribution data. These are formed by our project. Then you can go for the accuracy graph also. So this is the overall accuracy of the project. This is the overall accuracy of the project. The training accuracy of the project was 0 0.98, which is good, very good when compared to the existing system, deep neural network. Our, we are using RNA, recurrent neural network. So this is the poor as well as average as well as developed. Developed country was around 30%. Average country was 25%. Then poor country was 45%, still in work. Okay. We need to get this project means Please approach ITRBEXPERT.com. We will give you this project for better cost. Thank you.